Hey, this is Aaron with SimpleDix.com. In today's release, we made a bunch of improvements on how to set service fees for general admission and FlexPass events. Let me show you how it works now. Okay, so we'll start off by creating our event here. This is the first step of the Create Event Wizard. In this example, it's going to be a general admission event, so I'll select my date and time right now. And it's not reserved seating, so I'll leave this as no. All right, so I'll click next. And now we'll set our ticket types. So I'll say, look at the student rate here. And there will be a maximum of um, 200 students. And the ticket price will be $25. Now, if I'd like to set a service fee, I can totally do that. I'll click settings here, and I'll choose what type of service fee I'd like to do. So by default, I'll absorb the fee, which means there'll be no fee at all to the buyers, and all the credit card processing fees and simple tax fees will be absorbed by me. However, however, if I'd like to pass this over to the ticket buyer, I can click here, and we'll automatically assess the service fee at the time of purchase. So the buyer will pay both the credit card processing fee as well as the simple tax fees. Now, if you'd like to charge a very specific fee, you can totally do that. Just click here. And if you want to charge a flat rate of you know, $2.50, you can totally do that. And there's a little option right here called recommended fee. And what it'll do is it'll calculate the fee automatically for you. Um, but if you'd like to charge a flat rate fee um, and you have it pre-set up, just, just type it in like that and there it will be set like that. Now the benefit of choosing this option right here called pass ticketing fees on is if somebody has a promo code that reduces this ticket price, so let's say for example the ticket price is $30 and they have a 50% off promo code, what happens when you use, choose this option right here is we'll automatically calculate their per ticket fee based on the reduced price of uh, $15. I'll show you what that means in a few minutes. Let's go ahead and uh, continue right now. Okay, so we've created our event. Let's test it out. Um, I'll copy our link right here to go directly to our event page. Okay, so here's our event page. I'll click Buy Tickets. And you can see here that the fee is $2.22, and that's calculated automatically. Um, so I will add one ticket to my shopping cart. Now, before I check out, let's do this. Let's put in a promo code for 50% off. And you can see our fee has been automatically reduced as well too. Um, so as I mentioned before, with Simple Six, when you choose to pass over all the service fees, we'll recalculate the service fee at the time of purchase. So if they put in a promo code to reduce the ticket price, well, the fee will also be reduced. Let me give you an example of what we were speaking about earlier with the flat rate tickets, where there's a flat rate fee. Let me show you what that would be. So let's say adults are um, 200 and the price is $30. And they have a fee um, where it's a, it's a custom amount. I'll put uh, $2.50 in here. And I'll click save on this. All right, let's try buying an adult ticket now. So um, I'll go over here and remove this ticket from my shopping cart. And I'll buy one adult ticket. So you can see um, the adult tickets with the promo code, it remains the same price. Um, so if you remove the promo code, it's $250. And then I put in the promo code in of 50% off. The fee stays the same because it's a custom amount. While when you pass over the service fee to the buyer, that other option, it gets reduced automatically. So this also works for FlexPass events the same way. Thanks for watching our video today. If you've enjoyed it, click the like button and also click that subscribe button down below. That way every time we release a new video, you get a notification.